Metaverse cryptos are set to have a massive year in 2022. While much of the market has seen a lot of volatility to start off the year, one of the key things I'm going to be looking for in 2022 is how we're going to continue to see mass adoption of crypto, how more people are going to get involved. And that is directly through Metaverse and play to earn NFT games. So I came across a project the other day um, that really checked off all the boxes for me. All of these toys right here are my dog's toys. I have a French bulldog and this project in particular is similar to other projects we've seen in it uses 3d scanning technology but it specifically relates to people's pets so in my opinion when you're looking for a play to earn nft game a metaverse project that's going to have mass adoption my opinion it's going to be something that is something people regular everyday people really enjoy and is going to actually get them in the door into the crypto world which in my opinion is going to be with with this project in particular. So the project I want to talk about today is going to be called Classic Doge. And when I came across this name, I thought it was just another meme coin. It was just another, you know, one of the thousands of meme coins out there, but it's not. They use the name Classic Doge, in my opinion, because a lot of the time when people first get into crypto, they bought Dogecoin, they bought Shiba Inu, they used Robinhood, they used all of these easy and friendly platforms. And that's the reason why I believe they named it Classic Doge. But when you look at what they actually do, this roadmap and their play to earn NFT game, their NFT marketplace, all of this is actually very useful and very interesting. So the project is called Classic Doge and essentially it's helping to bring your real pet to the metaverse. So. You could buy their token XDOGE, but I really want to talk more about the utility of this project. So the way it works is you're able to capture your pet using all like, you know, scan your pet just by taking a picture and create an ultra HD 3D NFT that you can then use in the game, in these different games and in the metaverse. And this is a very interesting thing because this is the first ever metaverse where you're able to have a 3d avatar of your pet play and you're able to level up you know get earn rewards and sell that nft if you wanted to but the key thing here is that you're going to be able to upload your pet and mint this into an nft that you can use um, in social marketplace and metaverse and you can eventually even monetize so love the graphics right here pretty cool how they do this this actually looks exactly like my dog but um that's besides the point so with this project right here when you look at their um white paper we can take a look at this in a minute. But the key things I want to talk about are, first of all, what their goal is. The goal is, is obviously metaverse cryptos are gaining a lot of traction and they're trying to appeal to the masses by using people's pets and targeting the pet space. Because one thing that people love more than just about anything else are their pets. So for people to be able to go and use and play in the metaverse games using their pet as an avatar is something in my opinion that is going to get a lot of people involved because I would want to just scan my dog, see what he looks like, see how good the graphics are and see it actually go about playing in a game versus just playing in another game with a random character. I would much rather see how my dog looks than use any other 3D, like using any other random um, character. So with this, they have a couple of different features of um, Classic Doge. So first is going to be pet NFT token. So this is when you scan your pet, you create your own 3D avatar that can be brought, used in, in the metaverse, and used in multiple different games. Second thing is that by owning and staking your pet avatar, you're able to participate in the pet DAO. So that's a decentralized autonomous organization, basically meaning that for all future decisions of this game, you're going to be able to help make decisions by simply owning and staking your own pet avatar. This is important. Key aspect of crypto is that it's decentralized. So being able that you can help make decisions is also pretty important as well. Second thing that I want to talk about is going to be with the social NFT marketplace because they do are planning on making a peer to peer platform where you can create an NFT from your real pet. You can add on accessories to it and you're going to be able to um, actually yield pet tokens 
every 24 hour generate some passive income you're able to get those accessories for your avatar you're able to buy and sell on their marketplace and this is going to be very crucial moving forward for any any metaverse game you want to be able to buy and sell these different um, nfts third thing is going to be with the actual game mechanics in the game you're going to be able to train take care of your pet just like you would in real life and i think this is going to attract a very new audience to the crypto world that a lot of that probably wouldn't have gotten involved in the first place because people love their pets and this isn't just going to be for kids i think this would be also for adults as well third thing is going to be with the next thing i don't know if it's third or fourth next thing is going to be with events and competitions so in the game you're going to be able to have different clothing you're going to be able to purchase wearables you're going to be able to continue to build and you know earn in this game by building up the different accessories that your pet has and i think this is something that is pretty cool and last thing is going to be with pet breeding so there's a lot of metaverse cryptos out there there's a couple that i've talked about where your nft can like evolve over time almost some of them you start from an egg the egg might hatch we've talked about a couple like that but with this project you're going to be able to take your digital pet um which is scanned into an nft and you're going to be able to use this with different traits, different skills, different types to breed new versions and new NFTs if you would like. So it's not just that you have your own pet that has been scanned into an NFT, but you're going to be able to use the traits from the game and make brand new NFTs. So in my opinion, this is a pretty cool project. They're fully doxed. They have cool idea. And if you're looking for metaverse cryptos, the ones that are going to succeed are the ones that people are going to play. Which ones are people going to play? Well, in my opinion, if you're able to use your own pet, you're able to make, you know, take down those barriers to entry so it's not intimidating. I think that's the perfect recipe for a successful game. Eliminate the barriers to entry, make sure people feel comfortable, feel like it's easy to use, feel like it's fun, and I think that's going to attract a lot of people. On top of this, with the name Classic Doge, they're going to get all the people in the Dogecoin community, even though it's not related to Dogecoin, they just are going to help attract that same audience. So I think it's a great project, I think it has a lot of potential, and their roadmap um, the different features of this metaverse play to earn NFT game, all very cool. So let me know your thoughts on it, but I hope you enjoyed today's video and I'll see you guys in the next episode. See ya.